Hey, back again. Okay, so I just did the smoky brown eye, um, and then last week I did um, a fishtail plait for Lydia. Uh, it's a photo shoot for Reveal magazine. That's going to be out in a week or two. Um, and uh, lots of people asked how to do a fishtail plait. So here we go. I split the hair into two. Um, okay. Can you see? Oh, I hope so. Right, okay, so split the hair into two, and what you want to do is you take a little bit of hair from the outside of each set of each, so you've got the one and two bits, so from the first bit you take a bit from the outside, bring it over to the, <laughs> to the other bit, other section, and then the outside of the second section over to the first section. So it's literally just two sections. It's not like a, a regular pattern where you split it into three. And every time you just take a small section from the outside, really, really fine amount, and bring it over to the inside of the other section. So it does take a while before it starts to take shape. Um, you just have to keep with it. It, take, it can be a bit of a... I have to get going and it looks like it's not really amounting to anything and then all of a sudden it all um, makes sense. Can you see just tiny sections? I mean the smaller the sections you'll get, I don't know if you see in magazines sometimes those really fine fishtail plaits. Um, that would have taken quite a while. They'd have used literally just like a few strands of hair, but it does it does take a while. And I sort of think it's best just to practice, uh, get the technique right with slightly bigger sections to start with. When you've um, got the flow going, then then start using um, or you know you've got more time in your hands, just um, try out doing a really fine one. They are look they do look really cool. So you see what I'm doing just from the outside over, from the outside here over, it's just starting to come together. Just continuing down. So thanks for all your tweets. Um, I really appreciate them and I have I have some people say some really lovely things and I really appreciate all the um the tweets and the compliments, it's lovely. I will try and do um regular videos now. So I'm just still going So where I started off at the top there with the bigger sections, it kind of looks like a normal plait. <clears throat> but to be honest, when you're just learning like this, it'll be the best way to um, to go really. And then you'll have a bit of a secure base at the top there so the plait won't fall apart. And then you can use really fine sections. It's probably one of the fiddliest things a fishtail plait just because it's it's actually really simple in the in the fact that it's just two pieces of hair um and tiny bits of crossing over but it's just the time it takes and Can you see that coming together? Come on, that's my stomach rumbling.
This is probably really boring to watch. I think what I'm going to do is... Um, I've done quite a bit there. And I hope you've got the swing of the technique. What I'm going to do is stop it. And... Um, just continue down so you can see what it will look like once it's finished. So you can you can see it coming together. I'll stop and I'll be back in a moment. 